What's happening? Where's my MacBook? I just don't know. Now I'm here. Or nowhere. Or everywhere. I can see my MySpace page from here. Can you hear me? Can I hear me? Alexa, can I hear me? Sorry, I don't know that. But I do have a skill you might like. I'm thinking in real time and saying it or hearing it. And it's all me, no one else. Awesome. But where am I? Am I stuck between worlds like a timeline fracture, endgame style? Do I have an infinity stone? Maybe I fell asleep googling myself and now I'm in a perpetual state of self-awareness. Maybe I'm stuck in a lag in the internet. My service has been pretty rocked lately, what with all the Fortnite I've been playing. The system wasn't built for this, we should take it easy. But what else is there to do but exist? Shit. Now I'm wondering, why am I doing this? What's the point? Why go online? Why set up the phone camera? Why even bother making these stupid fucking things and in a few years we'll look desperate and insane like binge watching Tiger King or investing in 3D printing? It's not Star Trek. It is cool. And if you're into dice, yeah, maybe, but you're just bored. Get a drone. I remember when I cared about McDonald's Happy Meal toys and I ate all the fucking meals and I was pissed as hell when they didn't give you the toys with breakfast because I had to collect them all like a Pokemon master with night sweats. And now looking back, yeah, some of the sets were cool, but the high blood pressure and eerie feeling like I need a Big Mac whenever I pass a truck stop, which I'm pretty sure is a chemical imbalance because my DNA adjusted to whatever mutant genes are in Happy Meal foods. Kind of sucks, sucks I didn't get superpowers, but, but if McDonald's foods ever become sentient and threaten our lives, I can sniff them out, so I got that going for me. The impulse to do things in the face of uncertainty. What's that about? Why? Why can't we just exist in the nothing? Oh shit, I'm having an existential crisis. Ah, fuck, I always knew I'd have one of those, just not... Well, now is as good a time as any, I guess, right? Stuck in the void right now, realizing you've got no other reason than what you decide to whip up in your Cuisinart mixer called your brain, making life avoid itself. And also, I want mashed potatoes right now. Guess it's the perfect time for a little existential anxiety, but what the fuck is that? It's kind of hard to Google in the void. I'm gonna take my best stab at it from all the Medium articles I read, so don't go too hard on me, whomever you are. Fuck, Fuck, who am I? I? Who are any of us? us? We're born against our will. We exist by a few simple laws of physics, and then that's it. Song's over. Flip the record. Oh, wait, you can't, because you're dead. So what's the point? Sartre said, existence precedes essence. So I got to determine my meaning in life, which I guess works out, because I don't want anyone telling me how to do me. So, okay, I'm me. So there, it's I'm me. Or is that Descartes? Fuck. Can I phone a friend from the void? Sorry, I don't know that. Kierkegaard was all about the absurd. Like, there is no meaning in the world beyond what meaning we give. Because we decide what meaning means and what we mean when we say we mean it. So, okay. So I'm me. I mean it. Fuck you, void. You bore me. You got pizza rolls? No, didn't think so. Satra wrote about facticity. And that's like whatever you did in your past informs your future if you learn from it. So whatever I was doing a second ago only matters if I can use it for my future. Because no matter what, it's there. It happened. I googled existential dread and went down this wormhole. Holy shit. That's it. I got high and googled existential dread. More specifically, angst. Which comes from the idea that your species is creating itself. Nothing is guiding you, but what you decide does. Like standing on a cliff and not being scared of falling, but more afraid you might throw yourself off, because you're in control of you. Fuck, I did it. I'm out. Here's the thing. There's a lot of bad happening. We know that. It's going to get worse. We know that. And then it'll get better. We know that too. What's happening now is more important because it's what you're going through. 
Living in the now is what we got right now. So take it easy on yourself. We're on a decline. So ease off the brakes and the gas and just steer for a bit. You want to write a song? Write a song. You want to stare at the wall and cry? Do that. You want to write a song about how crazy you look when you stare at the wall and cry? Definitely do that. That's metal. Live in the void and create what you want. Or don't if you don't want to or got nothing. What you do now is for you and anyone who asks or needs it. That's the point. That's a point you can make in the void. And it's just the starting point. From here, it goes where you want. Because you're you. Yep. Probably not going to look back on that and think it wasn't a douchebag or anything. (laughs) 